Then Adam said to God, I wither in the heat, I am faint from walking, and I am loath of this world, and I know not when you will bring me out of it to rest. And then the Lord God said to him, O oh Adam, it cannot be at present, not until you have ended your days, then I shall bring you out of this wretched land. And Adam said to God, While I was in the garden, I knew neither heat, nor languor, nor, near, nor moving about, nor trembling, nor fear. But now, since I came to this land, all this affliction has come upon me. Then God said to Adam, So long as you were keeping my commandment, my light and my grace rested on you. But when you did transgress my commandment, sorrow and misery befell you in this land. And Adam wept and said, O Lord, do not cut me off for this, neither smite me with heavy plagues, nor yet repay me according to my sin. For we of our own will did transgress your commandment and forsake your law, and sought to become gods like you, when Satan the enemy deceived us. Then God said again to Adam, Because you have borne fear and trembling in this land, languor and suffering, treading and walking about, going upon this mountain and dying from it, I will take all this upon myself in order to save you. Then Adam wept more and said, O oh God, have mercy on me so far as to take upon you that which I will do. But God took his word from Adam and Eve. Hey, what are these circles? Oh, these are the roots in which all planets move around the sun. So, sun is in the center. Yes, you're right. Let me tell you something. A group of Roman people discovered about the solar system. So they named everything in Roman. Like, these circles are called orbits, which means moving around in Roman. Orbit, orbit. I am the sun. I'm a burning ball of fire. I'm very big indeed. Life on earth depends on me. We both orbit the sun, he's the big shot. I'm the center of the solar system, I'm so hot. You are my eldest son, Jethery. We will have one son in the top and one in armor. You know our wishes. And Lucrezia must be. I have met a woman, mother. You could leave the church and displease your father, if you dare. It is your destiny to follow in my footsteps. Tell me you accept this calling. <laughs>